That's where we're actually <laughs> moving on to next. Because, I mean, that makes sense. We did talk about comedy, the drama series, though. Better oh. Call Saul, which, is, of course, is the Breaking Bad spinoff. That actually, it, you know, wasn't nominated. It hasn't gotten the love through the years, of course. The last season just aired. So if they're going to get any kind of love, I think it's now. And I think that's why the critics' choice was like, let's give them some kind of, like, credit for being such a good spinoff from a different show. I mean, from Breaking Bad to this, normally spinoffs like this don't do that well. But you have a great cast. So you nominate, you got Best Actor, Best Supporting Actor in a Drama Series. It won both that. You know, it won Best Drama Series. It's like Sabrina said, it's, it's pretty big for a show like that to win all that. But then again, it is its last season. So I think that's why the Critics' Choice actually – put some more weight on them as a series because they won't be back up. They won't get an opportunity and they haven't gotten that love before. Um, Chris and Joanna, what do you think about them when you think that makes sense why they would kind of sweep in a way better call Saul? Or do you think that other people got screwed? You have nothing to say. I think I, 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 <laughs> <laughs> I, like I think the whole thing is rigged. Well, in a way it's, it's, it's you know, it's, you know, it's, it's kind of rigged in a way. <laughs> I mean, I think that obviously if, you know, if Susan Lucci was going to go off the air tomorrow and, you know, and she had been nominated 64 times. Didn't she die? No. Oh, oh, she's not dead. And she That's won. Cool. Didn't she won? She won eventually. She got that Emmy. 34 seasons later, right? I mean, yeah. like, the whole yeah. point was like, that was, if you're, that was if you're, if you're Susan Lucci, I don't know if, she's still alive. if you're Susan Lucci, it means that you kept being nominated yeah, and you but, never won. That's okay, the whole that point. Like, question. always a bridesmaid, wait, never wait, a bride. That wait. was Susan Lucci. Well, that, was my, that wasn't my mm -hmm. question. I thought she died. Sorry. She's okay. not dead. Anyways, just to be clear. Not dead. Point not being dead. that I agree with what Brian said, which is, Obviously, I personally feel like if something is going off the air and you do feel like it's it's missed its opportunity in the past, that you're going to want to sweep away most things like, you know, unless it was like a huge Hail Mary pass from another show that so came give, barreling through. So give them, to give better, them the award? Yeah, if, if it's a decent series that is run Why for a really long time i feel like it deserve. i feel like that deserves uh the possibility more than potentially Why? a brand new it, show that, make any sense. that you're like oh this show is give gonna the go award to the person that did the best i heard breaking bad is doing another spin-off star starring steven urkel are you serious is that a serious thing i don't know who you are but is that well, serious that, i need that, to know is that breaking news on breaking bad i don't know this is brand new information. Urkel? I have not heard of this. Yes. That is. That'd be awesome if Jaleel it was. White. I think they're joking. <laughs> Jaleel. Jaleel right. White coming in hot. About, I don't. Yes, family matters. Well, Urkel. Urkel. <laughs> That's why I said yeah. it. Urkel. But I, I, I agree. Like the thing is, like it's it's one of those things. It's 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 coming towards an end, so it makes sense. They're like, let's give it some love, you know. End of the it's day. It's been a really good series for many them, years. It's like a mercy. Like uh, it's like a mercy. Here, like a mercy. Go. here yeah. you go. Like, here, here's something before you go, right? You got it twenty two years ago. Okay, hold on. You're making it seem like it's not worthy of winning an award. It's a really good series. It's it is a really good really series. well for a really, really long time. Good. So really I mean, good. I'm not. I'm not yeah. mad at it at all. I think that they do deserve some recognition. I, I well, agree. And it's also Even like, though I, I don't care for Moth Gideon. Well, but, and I mean, I don't know how many times it's been nominated in the past, but I do know that, you know, it's like this nomination did not come out of left field where everyone was like, uh. Right. It was nominated for the Globes too. And it's nominated for the SAG Awards. It just right. didn't win so the it, Globes, you know? So that's what I'm saying is it's not, I don't feel like, and because of the fact that this, you know, I don't want to. I don't want to bash the Critics' Choice Awards, so I'm just going to leave it at that. I feel like it deserved to win. I'm glad that they went out and 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 put it and and sent it out with that flair. I feel like that's appropriate. Yeah. yeah, I think it's great. I like the show too. I think it deserves it. So good on them. Congratulations to that because they deserve it.